Hey guys, it's Judy, and so this is haul number three. And um, so this one is from Chic Tags. At first I was like, who sent me this? Because it didn't, it was like handwritten, and even the return address was like from Fresno, and I was like, P.O. Box, and I was like, who sent me something? But anyway, it was an order I made from Chic Tags. It was Labor Day sale. Um, so... Anyway, it was like 35% off or something like that. I think it was Labor Day. It was a holiday. It must have been Labor Day. But anyway, wood veneers from the Let's Go um, um, collection called Traveling. So these are all the wood veneers. I have like wood veneers that last me a lifetime. So, mm, I am baking banana bread right now. So, mmm. It smells nice. It's almost done, so let me get through this. So this is called the Places one. So you have traveling and you have places. So super cute and good size. So these are the ones. And then I also picked up these tags, which I know Sherry. Hi, Sherry. She's scrapping and wrapping um, on YouTube and also plug in for her new channel. <laughs> It's, um, I think, oh, I don't even know the name. I think it's Sherry's Married Life. Super, if you're into clothes and hauls and stuff like that, more of that. And cooking and things like that. Definitely check her new channel out because she's awesome. So anyway, here is um, the tags that she loves. And so they had them. It's, what are they called? They're just labels. So I couldn't help um, but get them. And I love that they have blank ones so you can fill in your own, you know, stamp or write or whatever you want. And it adds a bit of color and just, you know, cute, versatile. And I got two sets of them. So this one is in the happy place. And then this one is called love note. So it has like the teals and the reds. Super cute for like Valentine's or your significant other or you know anyone you love. So um, that's that one. And this also everyday life journaling tags and of course I had to get it because it says on the menu. So I had to get that. I'm not gonna open up each one and show each one, but if you want to see it, you can ask me. <laughs> but like I was saying, I'm baking banana bread because. Um, Aiden's new school, I joined their PTO, and and there was a, um, a program um, where you can bake or make meals, and then they store it in, like, a freezer, and then for those families that are in need, whether they're, um, they just need meals because either they suffered a loss or they had a baby, something joyous. It could be either way, you know, where they don't have time to cook and stuff. And, you know, they send them, you know, all these meals. So I'm baking up, like, four loaves of banana bread right now while Aiden is sleeping. Can you believe he's napping? He never naps. So I took him on a car ride. I can't do, like, two things at once. I can't talk, show this. And so I'll be quiet. <laughs> but anyway, I, I was taking him somewhere in the car. He fell asleep, so I just drove back home. <laughs> And made the bread, banana bread. So these are cute. So these are schoolhouse, so perfect for the fall. Um, and then these. Oh, let me just take some of these out. You know me. I like to show everything because you can see the packaging on the, on the website, right? But you want to see how bright they are, how vintage-y if they look washed, if they look white, or craft, or whatever. And let me stay in focus, guys. Oops, is that in focus? There. So I am filming on my iPad. Um, yep. Usually for my haul videos, I um, film. I love this one. I film on my iPad because they're not as long as my process videos. Process videos, I use a camcorder, FYI. 
So I'm trying to answer questions as I'm showing my haul video. For the love of coffee. Hi, Jill. <laughs> I just think of her when I see coffee. <laughs> so, um, typewriter, and then pick day. And she, she always comments how she loves my haul videos, though she's on a freeze. Sorry. I'm definitely freeze after this. All right. So, schoolhouse embellishments. So these photo toppers, so I love this um, shape. So definitely add it to a corner. I love um, stapling these to stuff. So I'm at five minutes. I think I can show these. I have a bunch more, but I can show these things. So cute. So they have like spots of color and then just these sayings, you know. Big, big news. Besties forever. Today was awesome. Love that. And then these banners. I don't really like banners that much. Something about these sharp corners. I can never put it on right on my layouts. Um, triangles are okay. It's those banners because I got a bunch of them from Scraptastic and I really have a hard pro time putting them on layouts. But these look like fun. I can do these and these. It's those banner ones. I don't know. You tell me, guys. These I have a hard time putting on, like photos. Um, but these I like. Yes, epic. And this is live. Oh, my back is killing me. Just sitting on the floor. I <laughs> how you guys do it. I'm usually on the table. So anyway, more stuff. So here... Cloud Nine. I love this um, this collection as well because they have the bright colors. They have the mint and the yellow and the bright pink, which I love. Let's go through these because I think I can show these and then the rest are like labels and stuff. Oh no, I'm at seven minutes already. These are a lot and these are a nice size. Um, so, oh, two of each, so, let me just do this. So, other things, people have been asking me, how do I store all these, these millions and millions of cards, um, Project Life cards that um, I have, and good question, because I have a hard time using what I have, as you can see. I just have the kits. I do have the um, the close to my heart, the medium size um, box that I put my cards in. But honestly, the, it's just huge. And then so I've been kind of putting them in um, little boxes just to kind of keep the collections together so I know what they are and it depends on my mood and I also have like a shoe box um, everything's in the basement so I can't really show you here but this is also cloud nine squares um, and then I just um, line it all up like still in its like for those project life mini the or the themes and then oh these are cute for the themes and then also like the snap cards I do it like that I've also found well I started I got in the dollar spot those little accordion like coupon holders that I kind of put it in also I have some kits in um, or collections in um, oh this is cute in those like index card holders you know and those kind of work nice too because I don't get overwhelmed with too many cards and like I said I might just pick one core kit to work with at a time or one um, project life kit at a time and then what I do is if I have certain themes going on like travel or um, or birthday I will take those out specifically for certain photos same thing with stamps if I know I have like um, 
um, travel stamps I want to use or you know cooking or food stamps things like that and here are some the gold labels which are super cute you see the gold Ooh shimmer shimmery foil nice so I love the words and then also the labels and these are white with the gold and then these are cloud nine collection so I love the colors and then also I got this big one the schoolhouse label stickers which has labels and then also the words on the bottom and then last but not least here let me show these since I might have a few more minutes so this one oops is called let's go journaling tags so that's kind of how I organize stuff which isn't the best way and I started doing my own embellishments by color and then also category of travel and food and now I'm thinking school <laughs> school stuff um, theme so I have to show you that I, I had shared it on Facebook but I have not really done much since I organized it by color um, so I like collection and then color but this is so cute okay so that's that that's for chic tags um, I don't have here chictags.com there you go um, hope you guys are having a great week uh, happy hump day bye guys